the uh, competitiveness <coughs> innovation program ICT policy support program. And it's uh, led by Thomas and Gnocchi and involves 23. I don't know where, but it's okay. Maybe I can sit down so, so everybody can see. It's led by Thomas and Gnocchi and involves 23 institutions in 13 uh, European countries. It started in January 2011 and will end uh, uh, at the end of this year. So it, and it works in collaboration with the Atlas for All project. I think Emmanuel will uh, talk about it later. And in collaboration, close collaboration with the EC network, that is the European Assistive Technology Information Network. Um, so the objective of the Aetna uh, project uh, was to work at the uh, development of the Eastin 2.0 web portal, so improving the Eastin system uh, by adding new functionalities and, and extending the data set and extending the number of resources that are connected to the system, uh, with particularly uh, focusing on uh, ICT assistive product. So uh, the objective were to increase the performance of the system, to uh, increase the number of resources, to extend the domain model, so the model that is used to represent the resources within the Aetna portal. I will, I will give you a, a, a live presentation in a few seconds, so you will probably understand better what I mean by extending the domain model. And collaborating with the community of the Atis for All portal uh, to establish a possibility for the end user to rate the product uh, by encouraging user participation. Um, so the um, Aetna set up a, a, a web portal that provides uh, unified access to all the assistive technology resources that is available in all the languages of the European Union and that is designed to meet the information needs of all the stakeholders, including the end users, but also professionals, solution providers, policy makers, etc. Uh, let's have that. Quick look at the portal. So this is the um, the online portal. It's currently available on this web, uh, address that is test. Uh, project eu. Um, we expect by the end of the year to um, import this solution to the current Eastin portal. Some of you may uh, be familiar with the Eastin portal and the the look and feel, the design of the portal is similar to this, so we have maintained, we have built this portal upon the existing Eastin portal. This website allows you to search for information on uh, assistive products on organization that includes uh, companies, projects and service providers, uh, manufacturers, resellers of assistive technology com projects in the field of assistive technology. Um, and as a library that includes uh, articles, case studies, ideas, etc. So documents that are can, can be useful for uh, any stakeholder in the field of uh, assistive technology products. It's based on the information provided by a, a number of um, uh, online uh, databases uh, that are listed here uh, in, in different European countries. And within the ETA project, we managed to, in, to include new uh, resources. One is, is from the CERT uh, OIG database and the other one is from the Italian ITDCNR that is a, a database um, uh, specifically focused on uh, educational software for people with disabilities, for young children with disabilities. Um, the system allows you to search for products in using different search methods. There's also free text search. I will uh, uh, now use the ISO, classific ISO 9999 classification method. So you can browse the classification and select uh, the most appropriate code. This is a, a three level uh, classification. So for example, I may select uh, input software. And when I click on this button, it performs a request to all the databases that are connected to the system and give and retrieves the, the list of results. So these are uh, the products that are available through this uh, network, and I can go into the 
into the each product and see the detail of the product. So I have some basic information like the name, uh, the manufacturer name, when it has been inserted into this database, uh, the name of the database, and then all the picture, and, all, and then also some technical details. These are described according to a taxonomy that we have defined within this uh, uh, Aetna project, and then the standardize the way the products are described across different databases. Um, it includes uh, contact information of the manufacturer and uh, um, also leads to other other information such as the download uh, website, manuals, video if, if any video is available, and also allows to cross uh, for cross links uh, with other section uh, of the website. In this case, it's empty, but uh, other other sections that are not empty, hopefully. Let's try another one. Okay. So, for example, we have four case studies that describe uh, the use of products in this category, so similar to this, uh, that is a camera-based mouse, I think. Um, okay, very briefly, this is uh, the Vietnam website. Uh, just one thing more I want to add, uh, there is also a facility for developer, manufacturer uh, of assistive technology that can uh, submit information about their product in order to be added to the to the databases of the Eastin uh, network. So you can uh, you give a, a brief description of your product, the contact data of the manufacturer, and information of uh, where it is supplied in the different countries and uh, who is the supplier uh, for for each country, if there is a, a different supplier. For, for every country. Um, as I said, it's completely available in uh, all the official languages of the European Union, so it's, uh, now it's available in 31 languages. Uh, we're still uh, translating some, some bits of it, so uh, some, some labels are still in English, but we're completely in the process of translating it. Okay, I think that was a very quick overview of the Aetna project that is about to end, so we will handle in, uh, in three in three months, and we will import all those features to the existing Eastern website. Okay. So, if you have any questions for this, or uh, we can say some words about how are we going to connect this with Cloud for yeah. All? This is this will be um, uh, a source of information for the. Cloud for all unified listing. So the idea is to uh, base, base uh, some of the information that will be stored in the Cloud for all unified listing. That is a listing of all the available solution to ICT access, including assistive technology software, but also mainstream uh, accessibility features in mainstream products. Um, Aetna and Eastian, let's say, could represent will represent one of the sources of information for this uh, unified listing and we'll, we are in the process of establishing uh, a connection with the cloud for all infrastructure and um, a bidirectional federation so that every modification that it's made in a, pro of a product that is available in the EC network is reflected in unified listing and, and, uh, and vice versa. This is currently the state of the art regarding this project and the connection with Cloud for All. Any other question? Sorry, thank you. Yeah, we can do it.